Okay, welcome back to American Truck Simulator. We are actually going to be delivering a excavator today. Uh, let's see if I could show the... Yeah, let's get back into the game. Um, we are... Let's see, here we go. Going from Corpus Christi to Victoria. And it's going to be... It's a 16-hour job for $6,000. Uh, we're going to be doing an excavator... Um, as you can see, I've got the webcam. I figured out how to get it to work through Outplay. And I got it to where you can see outside, so whenever I go, oh, hey, look, the baby ducks are here, or the deer are here, you'll actually be able to see them in game. I did intend to have an episode out yesterday I had recorded, but it actually didn't record for me. So we're going to go from here. I went from Houston to Corpus Christi. Okay, let's see where we go. Yeah, run this way. Or we're not. Oh shoot! I don't think I'm gonna build it. Or well, am I? Can I get through here? Yeah, looks like it. My intent was to have an episode out for everybody yesterday, but it didn't work out that way. But and I don't have much time to do it today. I've I'm working on a, a dock. Yeah, I found a guy had, um, was throwing away a bunch of old, well, not really old, but um, dock, dock material, like the, the planks and stuff like that. So I picked those up at the dump, and I grabbed a bunch of the hardware and stuff yesterday for putting a dock together. So I've got to run into town today and do a little more work on adjusting how I'm setting it up so it doesn't fall in the water with somebody on it. <laughs> okay, we're gonna we're gonna go do this little thing here. Let's check it out. an aircraft carrier in the background. Cool. That's something how they can get those two edges of the bridges to meet up. <laughs> that takes some engineering, that's for sure. Okay, well that was pretty cool. I've seen the construction going on. I'm glad I uh, came across it before we had a trailer. I guess I could have probably went straight. straight through or not. Well, it looks 
like the trailer is just right here too.
trucks are starting to come back. Yeah, see, they all, they're, they're heading out towards the garage because that's they know that's where I go to get the corn.
we got here? I might just park it this time. Yeah, we'll do our own parking this time. Not a hard one. Okay, it was only 152 miles, only took 20 minutes, 20 gallons used, and I hit 140 jobs completed. What time of the day is it now? 4.50. I guess let's jump into the job market, see if there's something, because it's only 4.50. Let's see if we can find something really close. Austin. So we could go back up to Houston, Galveston. We haven't been to Galveston yet. Uh, if they give us one there. Shoot, doesn't look like they're going to. Guess we could do Austin. So that's not too far. Yeah, let's do it. We'll get two jobs in on this episode. there before it gets dark. I don't think it'll register as being in Austin because it doesn't look like it was very close to the actual downtown, even though it's classified as Austin delivery.
the mall once, like, once a year, when I'm down in Illinois, I go and then I realize that I don't miss going to the mall. <laughs> Sam Goody when I was managing the, the Sun Coast. So we were just just down the hall from each other working. No, oh, come on. Babies outside the window. There we go. was a big part of my 
20s. I think I started, how old was I? It was 20... start working at the mall, I think it was. Can't remember. <sighs> eh, it was so long ago. <laughs> Good memories though. Some. <laughs> All except for the fact that when I was managing, I was working 70 hours. I, I think I talked about this before. That's the problem. It's like I run out of stuff to talk about. <laughs> and then I start repeating stuff. I can't remember. But And then I've got some episodes that I thought I recorded and they didn't record and I talked about stuff during recording those and they never got out there so it's like okay did I actually get that video released I talked about that so <laughs> it's like okay what do I talk about this time that I didn't talk about last time or 15 times ago you know hobbies what do you like to do for like collecting or um, like when I was I collected baseball cards and football cards when I was younger mostly for resale I talked about that in the past um, let's see I'm an ant keeper which you could tell by the title of my channel <laughs> northern ants um, and you can go back and check those videos out if you want to see some ants close up. I've got a lot of ant keeping videos on my channel here. And I still do. I don't have as many colonies as I when I first started the channel I was focusing on ant keeping. But there's just way too few people that are watching them. Which doesn't really make sense because there's that one channel, Ants Canada that has like millions of followers subscribers and they watch tons of videos and yeah the videos are okay I like the videos too I, I watch them once in a while I haven't watched one in a long time but I don't know I kind of like if I'm going to watch an ant keeping video I want to just kind of watch the ants he does a lot of other stuff with it I like to see the ants like up close, really cl up close stuff too. So that, that's why I like to film my own ant keeping videos because then I can film them the way I like to watch them basically. Which might be why I don't get that many views on it because maybe I'm the only one that likes to watch the videos made like that. For the ant keeping side of my channel that I guess that part of it's for myself, I guess, and a select group of people that have good taste. <laughs> oh, I hate when they put that they put that thing up there showing that I'm tired and they put it right over my GPS right when I need to turn. It's like, okay, I need to take that exit, but here, let's throw this up in front of you so you can't see where you need to turn. <laughs> There's a nice breeze coming in the window right now. It was so hot yesterday. It was like 83 or something like that. Like, it's 
like, I think it was 56 out there right now. So it's like I want to get all the windows open, get some of that nice air in here before it's supposed to get back up to like 80 and to the mid to upper 80s today. So get as much of that nice air in here and then get the windows closed before that heat hits. So we have a place to escape to when that high heat hits us. See how they have us parking this time. Yeah, easy one. Okay, I wanna let's before I pull forward I wanna get a picture of my my load on here. So we have a screenshot. they didn't have that like thing around the pointing at it so easier to take the screenshot that I can s pull from the video minutes, 18 gallons, <laughs> a gallon a minute, 
Yeek. <laughs> Not good gas mileage. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, I think that's where we're going to let off for today. I want to get into town. Get some stuff. Work on my dock. <laughs> okay, well, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Uh, look forward to talking to you in the comments. If you have any stories or anything, let me know. Happy to hear them. Have a great rest of your day.